Hi everyone, I'm Alika Lifty, and today we're going to brew Monarch on the AeroPress. As a more traditional blend, we really like Monarch as a single cup AeroPress because it's going to highlight the dark fruit and dark sweetness characteristics, as well as the rich, thick and syrupy body of Monarch. Some things we're going to need, you'll need your mug, a decanter, your AeroPress with funnel and stir stick, a doser for your coffee, and a kettle set to 205 degrees Fahrenheit. This AeroPress recipe is pretty straightforward and simple, the traditional version of the AeroPress, and we're going to be using 15 grams of coffee, ground fine. Not espresso fine, but not as coarse as you would do for any traditional drip filter offering. It's a pretty fine, finely ground coffee. And we're gonna be using 200 grams of water set to 205 degrees Fahrenheit. All right, to get started, we're going to wet your paper filter. I like to use this same water to also preheat my cup. So I'm gonna hold this right over my cup Give myself a good saturation of water and let that water drip through the filter. Screw back onto your AeroPress and place onto your decanter. Now use that handy funnel to dose your 15 grams of coffee. Remove and shake that AeroPress flat. Have your stir stick and your plunger ready to go for when we start brewing. Tear your scale, make sure your timer is set to zero and we're ready to go. First thing I'm gonna do, start my timer and I'm gonna pour all of that 200 grams of water. Start my timer. I like to move in circles just to get a little bit of extra agitation through the top of this AeroPress. When I reach 200, use that stir stick. And I'm going to stir until I reach 30 seconds. This is making sure all of my coffee is saturated and degassed. Apply your plunger. This is going to ensure that I don't drip too much through this AeroPress. It's gonna create a vacuum between the plunger and our water. And we're gonna let this rest for a minute and 30 seconds. At a minute and 30 seconds, I'm gonna plunge slowly for 30, finishing at two minutes flat. If I plunge this too quickly, I'm gonna force a lot of water and create channeling through this coffee bed. And I'm gonna get a watery, weak, tart cup that's gonna miss out on all of that rich sweetness of Monarch. If I plunge too slowly, I'm gonna enhance the sweetness, but I'm gonna lose some of the brightness of this coffee. And I love that citrus note that ties really well with our chocolate notes. Be sure to remove from your plunger and at a minute 30, begin plunging gently through the brewer, we should finish it two minutes. A steady plunge is going to ensure even flow and pressure through our brew bed. When you hear your AeroPress hissing, that tells us we're finished and we're pushing air through the coffee now instead of water. Remove that AeroPress. Be sure to dump your preheat water. Serve. And enjoy. When Monarch is brewed like this, it enhances that rich, smooth texture. And we get really nice citrus notes, like dried berries, mold wine, and we get a lot of rich, 
dark sweetness like molasses and dark chocolate. Enjoy.